ever pondered the question, what does the universe want? A question as vast and complex as the universe itself. The cosmos whirls in an intricate dance of celestial bodies, each with its own rhythm, yet part of an unfathomable grand orchestra. The universe, an enigma that has puzzled humanity since we first gazed at the night sky. Does the universe have a purpose, a wish, a desire, or is it a grand design of chaos, a cosmic game of chance? As we stand on this tiny blue dot, staring into the seemingly infinite expanse, we cannot help but question our place in it, our role in this cosmic play. These questions have intrigued philosophers, inspired poets, and challenged scientists. We've spent lifetimes trying to decipher the silent whispers of the stars, and in our exploration today, we dive into different theories and philosophies about the purpose of the universe. Philosophers of ancient times like Aristotle and Plato had their own interpretations of the universe's purpose. In the cradle of Western philosophy, ancient Greece, these great thinkers spun theories about the cosmos that have echoed through the ages. Aristotle, for instance, championed the geocentric model, believing that Earth sat at the center of the universe. His philosophy proposed that the cosmos existed in a state of telos, or purposeful existence, with everything from the stars in the sky to the stones underfoot having a predetermined role to play. Plato, Aristotle's mentor, had a different take. His philosophy was steeped in the world of forms, an abstract realm beyond our physical universe. In this timeless, perfect world, everything we see in our reality is but an imperfect copy. For Plato, the purpose of the universe was tied to this realm of forms, a concept that has been both celebrated and scrutinized over centuries. Travel a bit eastward, and you'd find another ancient philosophy in India, the concept of Dharma in Hinduism. Dharma, often translated as duty or righteousness, suggests that every entity in the universe, from the smallest particle to the largest galaxy, has a role to play, a duty to fulfill. It's a philosophy that paints the universe as a grand tapestry, where every thread has its place and purpose. In ancient China, philosophers like Lao Tzu propounded the philosophy of Taoism, which posits that the universe follows the Tao, or the Way, a natural order and flow that everything adheres to, embodying the harmony and balance in nature. These ancient philosophies, while vastly different, shared a common thread. They all sought to understand the universe's purpose, they painted pictures of a cosmos, imbued with a sense of order, purpose, and harmony. Yet, as we've journeyed through time, our understanding of the universe has evolved, often challenging these early ideologies. These ancient philosophies laid the groundwork for understanding the universe, but as we know, our understanding has greatly evolved. Fast forward to the modern era, scientists, with their advanced tools and technologies, have given us new insights. Insights that allow us to gaze deeper into the cosmos, peeling back the layers of the universe in a quest for answers. Let's imagine the universe as a puzzle. One piece of this puzzle is the Big Bang Theory. It's the prevailing cosmological model that explains how the universe expanded from a very high density and high temperature state approximately 13.8 billion years ago. This theory, as elegant as it is profound, provides a plausible explanation of our cosmic origins. Now consider another piece of the puzzle, dark matter. This is a form of matter that we cannot see, touch, or detect directly. Yet, it's believed to make up about 85% of the matter in the universe. Scientists infer its existence from the gravitational effects it appears to have on visible matter, like stars and galaxies. It's like the ghost in the machine, unseen, but undeniably influential. Then, we come across a more speculative yet fascinating piece, the multiverse theory. This theory proposes that our universe is not alone, but one of an infinite number of universes, each with its own laws of physics. Imagine that, countless worlds existing parallel to our own, each unique in its design. These modern scientific theories, the Big Bang, Dark Matter, and the multiverse theory, are like pieces of a grand cosmic puzzle. Each piece fits into the larger picture, providing a glimpse into the complexities and mysteries of the universe. But the puzzle is far from complete. There are pieces we've yet to discover, 
pieces that might radically change our understanding of the universe. These theories push the boundaries of our understanding, suggesting that the universe might be even more complex and mysterious than we ever imagined. Shifting gears, let's delve into the existential perspective. Existentialism, a philosophical inquiry that explores the problem of human existence and centers on the lived experience of the thinking, feeling, acting individual, offers a unique take on our big question. In the existentialist's view, the universe may not have a purpose in a traditional sense. Unlike the ancient philosophies that sought purpose in divine plans or modern scientific theories that seek to uncover an objective reality, Existentialists believe that the universe is indifferent, devoid of inherent meaning. It's a vast, infinite space that simply exists, indifferent to our desires, hopes and fears. But before you fall into a pit of despair, existentialism isn't all about cosmic indifference and nihilism. Quite the contrary. It's about freedom, about the power and responsibility we have to create our own purpose. This perspective sees individuals as conscious beings who exist prior to and apart from any definitions, labels or systems that might categorize them. We are not defined by the universe, but rather we define ourselves. So does the universe have a purpose? To an existentialist, the question might be moot. They might argue, why does it matter? Whether the universe has a purpose or not, we still exist, we still live our lives. The universe might not have a purpose, but we do. We create our own purpose. We give life meaning. We give the universe meaning. In this light, each of us becomes a universe in ourselves, a microcosm of meaning in the macrocosm of indifference. The universe may not care, but we do. We care about our lives, our dreams, our hopes and loved ones. We care about our world and our place in it. In the grand scheme of the universe, we might be insignificant, but to ourselves, we are the universe. So where does this leave us in our quest to understand what the universe wants? As we gaze towards the future of understanding, we see a horizon filled with possibility and promise. We stand on the cusp of an era where advancements in technology could bring us closer to answering the big questions that have puzzled us for centuries. Imagine the potential of quantum computers, machines that could outstrip the powers of traditional computers by leaps and bounds. They might help us simulate and study the most complex aspects of the universe, from the inner workings of black holes to the nature of dark matter, in ways we never thought possible. Then, there's the field of artificial intelligence. AI could become our companion in this quest, helping us sift through the vast amounts of data we collect from the cosmos, finding patterns and connections that the human eye might miss. This could bring us closer to understanding the universe's deepest secrets. And let's not forget about the burgeoning field of space exploration. With companies and countries alike setting their sights on the stars, we are likely to witness an unprecedented era of discovery. Probes and rovers could reveal more about our celestial neighbors, while manned missions could take us further into space than ever before. Each of these technological leaps brings with it the promise of fresh insights. They could help us unravel the mysteries of the cosmos inching us closer to comprehending the purpose, if any, the universe might hold. But remember, technology is just a tool. It's our curiosity, our thirst for knowledge, that truly drives this quest. As we continue to ask, to explore, to wonder, we are the ones shaping our understanding of the universe. So as we push our boundaries, harness new technologies, and dare to ask the difficult questions, Let's remember the power of human curiosity. It's what has brought us this far, and it's what will carry us into the future. As we continue to explore and understand, we might one day find the answer to our big question. From ancient philosophies to modern science, the question of the universe's purpose has intrigued us for centuries. We've journeyed through various perspectives, each offering a unique lens to view this profound question. We delved into the wisdom of ancient philosophers, who pondered the cosmos and its intentions. We then ventured into the realm of modern scientific theories, where we probed the universe's vast expanse and its intricate laws, seeking clues about its purpose. We also explored the existential perspective, questioning whether the universe has a purpose at all, or if it's simply a grand stage for life to play out its own dramas. And we looked into the future of understanding, 
where new technologies and theories might bring us closer to an answer. Yet it seems the more we learn, the more mysterious the universe becomes. So, what does the universe want? Perhaps the answer lies not in the stars, but within ourselves.